One century ago, in the fervor of a new American globalism, two men of vastly different backgrounds and social standing found their fates unexpectedly intertwined. Frank Vanderlip, the president of National City Bank of New York, saw Russia as a vast opportunity. Leighton Rogers, a fresh Dartmouth College graduate, signed on for the ride. National City Bank sent Leighton Rogers and his colleagues to Petrograd, the capital of the Russian Empire, to open the bank's first branch. Leighton Rogers wrote down everything he saw and experienced. Little did he know what was to befall him. Russians flocked to National City Bank with their deposits. Yet festering with revolutionary ideas, Russia was a cauldron ready to explode. Exuberant with success, Frank Vanderlip and his team missed the ominous signals that some Russians harbored other ideas. The Bolshevik Revolution in November 1917 forced the National City Bank team to escape from falling into Russia's cauldron. Now for the first time, their saga reveals its enduring messages.